Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, what's up? My name is VNA Strick. Thank you so much for being here. So today is a very, very exciting video because it is my collaboration reveal with a deck of Scarlet. I'm really excited to show you guys this month's kit and of course, you know, they've collaborated with me, so it's very exciting. I can't wait to show you guys how it looks on the face and all my favorite things about it. So I really hope that you guys enjoy this video. And if you do, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to join my squad. Let's get into it. All right, guys. So as a lot of you guys know, I've been talking about Deck of Scarlet for... A lot for the past couple months, but I've been working with them for a couple years now. I've been trying out their products and I love them. They are a makeup line and also a subscription service. They always release their monthly collaborations with very popular YouTubers. They're called the Artist in Chief. And this month, as you can obviously tell, I am the Artist in Chief. So it's so, so exciting. I think it's really cool that Deck of Scarlet wanted to work with me because not only are they an awesome brand to work with and everybody's so, so nice there, but they always, you pair up with very popular YouTubers and as you guys can tell I'm more of a smaller channel so I think it's really cool for a company to reach out to me like this and it just gets me really exciting I love what they stand for I love all their makeup and it's just really exciting so thank you guys I couldn't have done it without you okay so just to clarify one thing um, PR came out a little bit early because of the holidays so you obviously have already seen the palette if you do follow me on social medias or if you have seen other people review it so this video is me obviously the artist in chief showing you guys and if you are confused by what the artist in chief is um, I did not create this palette I did not choose the shades they just picked me to be the artist in chief which means I am the one that will be showing you guys the looks that you can create with this showing you guys the palette and really like revealing the month for you it's just really exciting because they gave me like all this responsibility and the opportunity to be the face of their palette of January. So it's very exciting, I hope you guys love it. So you don't get the same kind of format every month. They usually have a palette or they have kits. You do get a really good variety of things every month. This month, I'm really excited because you will be getting a full size palette. And by the way, if you guys are members, you always get a couple days before to preview the month of like what the palette's gonna look like or the kit. And you do have a couple days to skip it if you don't like it. So that's really cool. But I mean, why would you skip it? It's awesome. And when you do get a full size palette, um, the subscription literally costs only $29.95, which is less than one product that you could get at Sephora. So let's dive into this month's palette. You will get this um, in every single box so I think it's really cool because I wrote you guys a little note. I can read it to you guys real quick. It says, hey squad, my name is v &A Strink and I'm so excited to announce that I will be this month's artist in chief. I hope that you guys enjoy this day to night palette and this gorgeous glitter liner. I cannot wait to see the looks you come up with. Thank you for all your love and support, XO v &A. So you do get this with all my social medias and then you also get the inspiration behind the palette which I will read you guys right now. This is a very sophisticated yet undeniable sexy modern minimalist spirit that doesn't have to scream to make statements the smoldering nudes are elevated with a palette of diffused pinks foggy grays and shimmer sign metallics to create a totally blissed out vibe and this month you do get a really stunning go glitter liquid liner in the shade violet aura so this dynamic palette features three fully pigmented shadows, two lip colors, one highlighter, and one bronzer, which I actually use as a blush. And just remember, Deck of Scarlet is cruelty-free, vegan, and paraben-free, and they do ship to the UK, Canada, and the United States, and shipping to the United States is free. All right, so let's look into the palette. All right, so here's a glitter liner. This is really beautiful to amp up your look. It's very long lasting liquid liner and it lays down very multi-dimensional metallic pigments. Um, it is a water-based formula and it honestly glides on seamlessly with very high impact. And once it's dried down, it will not budge or transfer, it doesn't flake. And the formula actually contains actives that nourish and moisturize, which is really cool. All right, so the more red tone lip color is called Cozy Vibes and it is just a reddish brown um, color with a hint of pearl. And then we have the lip color Suede, which is a very smoky creamy shade so for the eyeshadows we have the shade serenity which is a really pretty creamy soft nude then we have haven which is a silvery pink shimmer and also we have unwind which is a very smoldering gray shimmer 
And for the blush and highlighter, the blush is called Plush, and it's a very lush pink shade. And then the highlighter is called Mindful, and the shade is a velvety pink with a hint of purple pearl. Like I said, I didn't create this palette, but I was given the choice to choose a palette, and I decided to go for this one because if you guys watch me on my channel, I... I don't usually go for cool tones and I don't step out of my comfort zone very much and I definitely thought that this was something different and I wanted to show you guys that you can do so many things with things that you're not used to. And also, getting something that you're not used to in a subscription, I feel like that's kind of the point of it. Um, you can always go out and purchase things that you know you're gonna like, but it's really cool to be sent things that you maybe normally wouldn't pick up and you realize you end up loving it so much. And it's cool to experiment. This might look a little bit scary but intriguing to some of you guys, so that's why I picked it and I think it's just a really cool vibe. I'm actually gonna show you guys how to do this look as well as another one this is more of like my daytime glam look and I also have a very very dramatic look for nighttime so um, I did prep my face off camera I did all my makeup except what I'm gonna apply on my face so let's get started all right so for the crease I'm actually gonna use a bronzer that comes in the palette called plush and I'm gonna put it on my crease and really just blow it out from inner to outer corner um, if you want your looks to be very cohesive, you could always throw your blush or your bronzer in the crease and it'll always come out really nicely because the colors match. For the lid, I'm gonna go in with the shade Haven, which is so, so stunning. I'm actually gonna go in first with a flat brush and I will wet it just to get that very metallic look. And I'm gonna do like a half cut crease. I'm not carving out my crease with concealer or anything like that because I do want more of like a daytime glam kind of look. And this shade is really pretty. It makes you look very awake and very girly and feminine and I love it. So to deepen out the outer corner, I'm actually gonna use the shade Unwind, which is also a shimmery shade. But just remember, you can use any kind of finish anywhere on your eyes. So I'm actually gonna use a shimmery shade to smoke out the outer corner and I'm also gonna put it a little bit on the crease to create a really pretty transition. It adds a little bit of smokiness to it, but it still keeps it very daytime appropriate, which I love. So what I'm actually gonna do is go off camera and apply some liner as well as lashes. And then I'm actually gonna use the highlight Mindful and I'm gonna put that in my inner corner as my highlight. This is a very pretty and unique shade. And lastly, I'm gonna highlight my brow bone with the shade Serenity, and this is just gonna give me a more lifted look. So I'm gonna use a shade Plush on my cheeks as blush, and it's actually such a beautiful shade, and I feel like it makes the look come together. And then for highlight, of course, I'm gonna use the highlight, and I'm using it with a fan brush so it's not as intense because it is pretty intense, and it gives a really beautiful, almost duochrome look. So again, I'm gonna be going off camera to line my lips with a cool tone purpley shade. All right, and then I'm gonna take the shade Cozy Vibes, which I feel like it might look a little intimidated and red on the pan, but once you put it on your fingers, it does kind of diffuse a little bit, and once you apply it to this lip liner, it does create a really beautiful cool tone pink. All right, and this is the look we created. Um, I just, I wanted to show you guys that first of all, you can use shimmer shades somewhere else other than the lid. As you guys can see, it created a beautiful like smokiness and made the pink almost look silvery. And then also, like I said, with these lip colors, you can really manipulate them to look however you want, depending on the lip liner that you want. So just remember that. But this is the first look and I absolutely love it. I feel very girly and feminine. Alrighty guys, so I'm actually gonna start out with the concealer that I use as an eyelid base wet. I didn't set it, so now that I'm gonna go in with the bronzer plush, it's actually gonna come off a little bit darker again, and that's because I didn't set my concealer. So like the first time, I am just gonna put that from inner to outer corner until desired pigmentation. Now for the lid, I'm actually gonna use this as a base for the glitter. So first I'm gonna put the shade Unwind, and it is a shimmer, but I'm not using it wet, just because you don't have to. Again, it's gonna be a base for the glitter, and it's honestly really beautiful on its own without getting it wet. So I'm just packing that on on my whole lid. 
And now comes the fun part. I'm going to take the Go Glitter Liquid Liner in the shade Violet Aura and I'm actually just going to paint that all over my eyelid. I am going to do like a harsh line so it's more just the eyelid that pops. And as you guys can tell, even though this is a liner, it spreads and applies so easily that you can actually use this as an overall glitter without having to use loose glitter and glitter glue. And it honestly looks really beautiful and I love the effect that it gives. All right, so while we let the glitter dry, I'm gonna just finish off the lower lash line. I'm doing the exact same thing that I did in the last tutorial. I'm just bringing the shade Unwind a little bit lower and then, of course, smoking it out with the shade Plush. I'm just making it a little bit more smoky at the bottom. And then to highlight the inner corner, I'm gonna use the shade Mindful and I'm gonna use the shade Serenity to highlight under my brow bone. So now I'm just gonna take the shade Plush and apply a little bit more on my cheeks to make it a little bit more intense. And same with the highlight mindful, I'm actually going to go in with a more detailed brush and I'm going to apply it a little bit more deliberately and make it a little bit more blinding. Okay, so now to finish off the eyes, I'm going to apply some lashes and I'll be right back. And to finish off the lips, I am going to go ahead and put on a lip liner that's a very brownie red shade. And I'm gonna go in with the shade Cozy Vibes first with my finger to give it that like very reddish tone. And I'm actually gonna mix Suede and it's gonna make more of a purple tone. So don't be afraid to mix and match the shades the way you guys like it. All right guys, so I went ahead and added some black liner in my waterline to make this even more dramatic. Look at this glitter. It honestly looks so pretty and it doesn't transfer up. It dries literally where you put it and I love it. I feel like this is really pretty for a night out. Definitely somewhere with lots of lights. Look at the glitter glistening. By the way, if you're wondering why the palette that I'm showing you guys looks unused, I actually have that one as a backup to show you guys. But the one that I've been using is right here. I've been using it all month and I love it. So like always, I do have a discount code for you guys, but this month is a little bit more of a discount. So I'm actually gonna give you guys 35% off your first palette with the code VNA35. It's just my first name and 35. And I will link it down below and link all the products down below and any information that you might need. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Um, I hope that you guys are proud of your girl for collaborating with such a big company. I'm so happy. Deco Scarlet, thank you guys so, so much for working with me. I really do appreciate it. You guys are lovely and I love you guys. And of course, I love you guys. Thank you guys for making all this possible for me. I love you all so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.